All right, update on the Toro Z Master 4000. We are changing the oil, um, changing the brake in oil out of it. We have 10.4 hours on it. I probably put mm, six or seven of those hours on the machine myself. My dad put two or three on there probably. Um, but we are changing the oil because you got to change it after the first 10 hours. We're going with some of this Kohler 20W50 synthetic engine oil blend. That's what our dealer recommends putting in these things. Um, there's the Kawasaki oil filter right there. Um, takes two and a half quarts for one of these machines. So far, I'm liking it. Like I said, only got 10 hours on it. Really like the seat. Seat's real comfortable. Um, I like the 10-gallon fuel tank. That comes in handy. Big engine was nice. We cut some thick stuff a couple different times. Some yards hadn't been cut all year. And we started cutting grass, you know, a month ago. Uh, maybe even a month and a week ago on some of them, so... That just kind of tells you how overgrown some of these yards were. It's handling it well. It's got this nice old drain hose. Comes out the back. You get an 11 16th inch wrench and a socket. And you take the little plug. Just break it loose. Then you can get it out with your fingers. That makes it nice. Oil filters in here. It should be easy to get to right here. Um, might make a little bit of a mess. But at least it will be easy to get to and easy to clean up. But yeah, like I said, after 10 hours on the machine, um, pretty nice, got a lot of power. We did add the advanced chute system, chute to it, which we run open 90% of the time and just close it if we don't want to blow on to something or anything like that. I'll probably take the blades off, sharpen them today. They are needing, needing probably a little bit of sharpening, but yeah. Um, it's nice, I like it, and hopefully once we get a little more hours on it, I'll have a little better idea of everything, but it is doing well so far.